Hello everyone, welcome to Digital Charcuterie. This is James. We're talking Zack Snyder's Rebel Moon. Give us a like, and if you're new to the channel, click that subscribe button, and don't forget to punch that bell to stay up to date with all the latest videos covering Rebel Moon in depth on this channel. Look for a lot of fun short videos like this one, and full in-depth conversations will be coming as production progresses over the next few months. Shooting has begun on Rebel Moon. Zack Snyder posted Earlier today, this tweet right here, day one, hashtag Rebel Moon, it's begun. Also, if you look back, April 12th, he posted this on his Vero account, test shooting, getting ready for next week, hashtag Rebel Moon. It is now next week, so we got our first looks right here. We got this this outdoor set right here, some green screen. Cameras are rolling, nice jib, some camera work, look at that. Woo, can't wait, this is going to be fun. Uh, from there, we actually, what you saw earlier last week was the interior of that, and this is the exterior. Right here, we see some of the crew walking up that ramp, more green screen. Look at this equipment going on the inside of this. Looks phenomenal as well. Great attention to detail. And oh, first look of the cast on Rebel Moon. Check it out. This is Digimon Hansu. Fantastic. And one thing Zack Snyder absolutely excels at, better than almost anybody. Well, you know what, better than anybody is first looks. If you can recall all the way back to when he did man of steel this was our first look right here at the man of steel superman and it was sick got you intrigued and excited then of course batflex first look who can forget that iconic image of ben affleck in the bat suit first one ever and then of course wonder woman's first look also iconic wonderful great design right there and this one is probably my favorite of the bunch to be completely honest with you this is the army of the dead first look sans tignataro of course who was not part of the production at that point but this is a great one and actually when you look at it after seeing the movie you're like oh that makes complete sense but now we get this first look look at this first look absolutely wonderful this is going to be Zack snyder at his best if you like if you are a Zack snyder fan this is a movie for you and the one thing that is phenomenal about this film that I don't think is getting touched on enough, maybe it is, but I don't personally believe it is, is the fact that Netflix is giving him free reign to tell his story. What he was meant to do with the Justice League of Warner Brothers was do multiple films. It was a big, epic movie, a series of movies, and they ended up make, forcing him to trim it down and eventually obviously getting rid of him, forcing in Joss Whedon to ruin it. But now Netflix is giving him free reign. You want to make this two movies? Make it two movies. And we're getting two movies, hopefully spinoffs. And of course, what he gets to do with the Army of the Dead stuff as well. Anyway, guys, this is all we got right now. First day of filming has begun on Rebel Moon. I'm stoked for it. Cannot wait. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Do these set images, these first images excite you? Are you looking forward to it anymore? Any less? Do you feel like maybe they don't mean anything? Let me know, please, in the comments below. Please give us a like and a subscribe. And until next time, may you be the master of your own universe.